Welcome back to Juyi Delpe. I have something a little more interactive for you today. Something I've been working on and I'm really excited to share it with you today. So it is a app that we're going to benefit from called Memrise. It's like flashcards, but you can play it like a game. You get goals and points and it's just fun. So you can make your own card packs. That's what's really great about the community being able to use it. Or you can use one that somebody else has already made for you, which I have done. So I've taken consonants, vowels, and tones, and this will start you off from the very beginning. You either have had no experience with Hmong and you're starting off fresh, or you've been in it a while and it's time to review some of the sounds and the tones because Maybe some of them sound a little similar to each other. This is the place to go. And another great thing is I've added audio to it. So you can hear the sounds and practice them, make the connection with what the consonant or the vowel tone looks like. You can hear it, say it, and test yourself. It's a lot of fun. Okay, so I have a question. Why is it so amazing? Well, like I said, it's a flashcard app, but smarter. It uses this thing called space-time repetition. What does that mean? Well, if you learn anything, there's this formula about short-term and long-term memory that our brain has <laughs> that this takes advantage of. And it knows when you need to recall these words back into your brain. So it'll pull them up throughout the day, throughout the next couple of days, throughout the next couple of weeks, and it'll help you to recall those words when it's most important, when you need to hear it, when you need to practice it. Especially, it knows the ones you're getting wrong and you need a little extra help with, and it brings them up sooner. So space-time repetition, proper repetition for you to be able to really mm, master those sounds and get them right. Smart flashcards. I'm super addicted to this app, and I hope that you will be too. Great, you say. How do I sign up? Well, I'll walk you through how this works. There's a couple of different ways to sign up. One you can do through the app on your phone, one you can do through the website. I'm gonna walk you through the website because by far that is just the simplest way, hands down, and once you get all set up with the program, then you can use the app on your phone, take it with you anywhere, and uh, it's much easier, but we'll get you started through the process right here on the website. Let's take a look. Memrise.com, you'll see it here. www.memrise.com. Go ahead and type that in. Now we're going to sign up. And this is the page that comes up next. Let's go ahead and make a new account. Okay, once you decide what you'd like your username and password to be, and you have your email address, click Sign Up. Now it comes here to what language do you want to learn? So just pick a language, it doesn't really matter, just to get in here to where the different courses are. Now what we're going to do is come up here to Courses. A point to remember, please save your username and password. You are going to need to use it again later today and in the future in case you get logged out of Memrise. Okay, now at this point, we're at courses, but Hmong isn't super popular, so where do we go to find it? Let's scroll down here to languages, click on that, great, and come to other, click on that, and once again, other language, click on that. And here we can hone in our search. Let's type Hmong there and enter. Great. And scroll down to this special pack I made for you. Click on this one. Perfect. This is the card pack that I made for you this time. Juyi Dope. Learn to read Hmong Beginner 1. You'll see that we have vowels, consonants, and tones. And the best part? There's audio so that you can practice. So this is where it all begins for you. Let me walk you through the program a little bit in case you're not familiar with it. First things first, you can kind of see what my chapter layout looks like. Vowels, vowels with tones, these vowels, these vowels, these vowels. We get down to consonants last. Here, let's learn. 
it starts you off at the very beginning. It shows you the vowels you're going to be learning here. This is the website version. On the app it will look a little different. So you can click here. Learn these words. Green will always be learn new words. When you get to this point it will play the audio for you and then it will automatically move next. Now that you've started learning these words they will automatically show up in any device that you sign into, whether you download it on your tablet, your phone, or you choose to use it here on the website. Any of these are now available to you. So go ahead and stop here if you like and add Memorize app to your phone or your tablet, whatever it is that you take with you so now you can have it on the go. And honestly, I prefer using it in the app myself. It's a lot more user friendly, easier, quicker, more portable, Everything seems to be a positive for me on that, but this is what it will look like on the website, so it's totally your choice at this point. You'll see here when you click on your card pack choices by category other language, this card pack will now show up for you and you can come and study it anytime you want. It's in your home bar. In time, this will give you different choices. It says you can review your flashcards. So say today you do your five minutes, Tomorrow comes around and it's going to remember what you need to work on again. So maybe review them. Those will be in blue. Review your flashcards first. Keep them in your short term memory so that you can build them into your long term memory and then you can use them and remember them and it's easier each time. And at the same time, don't forget to keep building on that. The green ones are learn new words. And there are also other features under more. Now, I'm telling you about the free version. In my opinion, at this time, you don't really have to do the paid version. There are different features you can get in the paid version, but this free version is more than sufficient. And I also want to mention a little bit about you and your username. It is super important that if there's more than one person in the home that would like to use Memrise and this card pack, Learning Hmong, it's super important to make separate accounts. One for you and one for the other member of the house, one for any anybody who is using this. This is a very personalized setup. It keeps track of what you know well, what you need to improve, and that can be very different from somebody else. So, make separate accounts for each learner. Perfect. So now that you're all set up, you've got your account ready, now it's time to practice your flashcards. <sighs> when am I supposed to do them? Often. Daily for sure. So all throughout the day. What is a good time for you? Do you habitually take your phone with you into the bathroom? Do you spend a few minutes in there? Practice your memorized flashcards. How about in the morning with your coffee? You take a few minutes. Practice your flashcards. Take a break at work, lunch break, practice your flashcards. And don't forget previous lessons where we've talked about exercise and how you make brand new brain cells and you can put this information where it needs to go and you can recall it faster. Do it while you're exercising, practice your flashcards. The most important thing is to find a time that's good for you. Find something that you do every day that you can condition yourself so that whenever I do this, I'm also doing my flashcards. They kind of go hand in hand, right? So that you remember, oh, I forgot to do my flashcard. And don't forget, the amount that you receive, the benefit that you receive is directly proportionate to how much you practice. If you find a lot of time throughout the day, every day, throughout the week, throughout the coming weeks, you're really going to master these sounds. Okay, great. You love this. Now you're hooked. You want more, right? Great news. It Just give me some time and I'm going to have some more card packs ready for you in the future. It'll gradually advance you through the language, words, vocabulary, sentences, structure. Just take a little bit of time to get them set up. But you have that to look forward to in the future. For now, practice these. Get the sounds right. And I'll have something amazing for you again next time on Juyi Jiao Bei.